Evening, I'm Rob Vaughn. I'm Wendy Davis. Pennsylvania's new mask mandate goes into effect in the morning. School kids, the governor, and the health department say you must wear masks. Governor Wolf recently changed his mind about that, and he said on the day after Labor Day, teachers and everybody else in schools should mask up. But some districts apparently think that's not right. They don't plan to comply, and some people are even suing the governor. WFMZ's Joy Howe reports. Back to school and back to masks. That's the word from Democratic Governor Tom Wolf, who said last month he decided after hearing from school administrators and pediatricians that there should be a mask mandate in schools, at least for now. He said that the day after Labor Day would be the deadline for the mask mandate, which affects everybody in public and private schools and daycares, regardless of vaccination status. But Republicans have already filed a lawsuit of their own. The Republicans the Republican leader of the state Senate and a group of parents filed a lawsuit Friday saying Wolf's mandate isn't valid because it didn't go through the state's regulatory review process. The suit also says that the Wolf administration failed to comply with state law when the masks were ordered to be worn in schools. The lawsuit seats an injunction against the masking order. A hearing is now set for September 16th. Meantime, the governor's camp has dismissed the lawsuit saying the GOP is, quote, undermining public health. State health officials said that more than 5,000 students have tested positive for the coronavirus since the start of the school year. Joy Howe, 69 News.